Okay, the setup on this boat for the jib tracks is our fixed sheeting position. Now this position's been determined based on the sail plan. Um, there's a whole lot of calculations you can do to figure out your sheeting position, but you're better off sticking with the uh, pretty much what the, the class leaders are doing and work on around about your 320 mils out from the center line as your average setting. Now if you have a look on the other boat over here, you can see that Peter's running a short jib trap. He's got a calibration of zero, which would equate to Hugh's uh, fixed sheeting position. Having these short jib tracks allows you to move these up slightly for flatter water, uh, lighter air, where you can sheet off a little bit, twist the head open, but still keep the, the foot of your jib in. As well as for windier breeze, where you want to be able to twist open the head of the jib. The natural camber of the deck, you can see Peter's also actually slightly um, moved the angles off the perpendicular to move this forward because obviously the camber of the deck changes the sheeting angle on the jib. So he's making sure his sheeting angle's ma um, maintaining an angle, but as he's moving it out, he's opening up his slot and coping for the additional um, changes when it gets windy.